Gear of reporting. Hello comrades. Assassin, Herald of Thunder. Giga expensive build. Mostly because of this rare staff, that everyone use. We can of course use Agnerit, but for end game content, we need something much better. In Ultimatum, a new unique item was added, that gives more damage, than Mira staff, and cost only couple exalts, or even less. Cane of Kulamok. This staff has 3 veiled boosted mods, which make this item very versatile, and fit almost on any build. But for Herald of Thunder build, we need this mods. And don't worry, this build's still very expensive. Also, we're using cast 1 damage taken in this build, since we have taken damage from our rings, Storm Secret. That gives us an opportunity to cursing, chilling, and much more, without even using the skills. Cane of Kulamak, like I said before. Impulsa, best armor for this build. Explosions, damage, life. That's all we need. Rare helmet, with plus 1 power charge, and 9% lightning penetration. Storm's Gift, best gloves for this build, very helpful, especially on mapping. 2 Storm of Secret, of course. And Amulet, with plus 2 to level of gems mods. Rest items is rare, with HP, and resistance. Large Third of Hope, right here. Glorious Vanity Timeless Jewel, with Door Any Mod. Mandatory item in this build. Lone Messanger, from Calamitous Vision Small Cluster Jewel, to double our damage. Our main skill, Herald of Thunder. As we see, we use Hypothermia, that's because we're using Cast 1 damage with Cold Snap, which create Chilled Ground, plus Wave of Conviction, and Immortal Call. Second cast when damage taken, with Crackling Lance, level 5 Awakened Hex Touch, Elemental Weakness, and Conductivity. Plus, Storm Brand. And since we can't use Auras, because of Lone Mess Anger, we can only use Aspect of the Spider. Pantheon. Ascendancy. Kill all bandits. Tree.
comrade. 